2016 Honda Civic Coupe. This car is the most ambitious, the most charismatic, the sportiest Civic we have ever created. So it's uh, about six o'clock in the morning and I'm running a little bit late for the airport. We should have left about uh, half an hour ago, but it'll be okay, it'll all work out. I'm on my way to uh, Southern California to go drive the new Civic Coupe. It's gonna be uh, about five or six hours of flight time, but it'll be well worth it when I get there. See you guys soon. So my flight was delayed uh, about two hours, two and a half hours actually. And because it was delayed two and a half hours, that would mean that I'd miss my connecting flight in Salt Lake City. It wouldn't make it to California. So when looking for another flight, I guess somehow Delta automatically rebooked me on United with the direct flight from Chicago right to San Diego. So that kind of all works out. Now I have to go to a different terminal, but I'm going to get there at the same time, if not a little earlier than originally planned. Well, I am at the San Diego airport. I made it here after... Delta rerouted me onto United, which is very, very kind of them because I got in actually a half an hour early. So now I'm going to go to baggage claim, find my car, and uh, get a ride to the Hard Rock Hotel. Those are my room keys. And the other side says Civic Coupe. And this is my room. Let's go check this thing out. Nice. Got a nice little bar there. Set my room keys up for a minute. Set my bags down. Got my Type R bag here, of course. You guys can see that. There you go. And I got my duffel bag here with my backpack with all my gear in it. San Diego, get yourself ready to experience the stylish new Civic Coupe. It's ready for you. See you tonight at 6.30 at the Elevation Deck on the 11th floor. Oh yeah! It's registration room. This is kind of, we're going to be having dinner here, we're going to have some other events here, and they have the whole place set up, very rock and roll themed, as you guys can see, and everything Honda does is always themed with all the cars and with us. A bunch of guitar picks. Take some of these home, I think, for sure. More pillows that are all themed. They ordered me some uh, fish tacos that look amazing. Eventually, I'm going to eat them. Let's see what we got outside here. What a beautiful, beautiful day. This is so sick. And the view is just gorgeous. Look at this. So awesome. Welcome to San Diego. Now it is day two and it's uh, breakfast time of day two. So we are gonna see what we have for breakfast. This is Civic Coop breakfast. I said, I can't show you the presentation because many things are embargoed. But there's Civic Coupe. Everyone's got all their names here. There's my spot. They usually put me right as close to the front as they can. There's some pretty cool stuff here. So sometimes you think you pack everything, but then you forget some things like toothpaste and a toothbrush. So I had a bar of toothpaste and toothbrush. So before we go on this epic drive, I'm gonna brush my teeth so my breath don't stank. Generation 2016 Honda Civic Coupe. This car is the most ambitious, the most charismatic, the sportiest Civic we have ever created. Now you'll notice the front of the vehicle and the windscreen is actually common with the sedan. So we have the same reduction of one inch at the front on the rear, on the front overhang. So we have this longer, more premium hood. And the car itself is also two inches wider than the outgoing city. 
Now, some of the differentiations uh, from the sedan are that we've reduced the height of the roof by almost a whole inch, and then we've shaved an additional five and a half inches out of the rear opening. That was awesome. Yeah? Okay. Yeah. I think everything sounds so good, man. Yeah, man. <laughs> Thank you, Jay. No prison for you. As I'm finishing this presentation, Guy Melville Brown, the lead exterior designer, just handed me this. How sick is that? That's totally going to be framed and put in my office for sure. That's amazing, brother. Thank you so much. It was no problem. awesome. No problem. Hey, guys, this is what I've been waiting for. It's the drive of the 2016 Honda Civic Coupe. I have my co-pilot here, Parks. Good morning. What's up, dude? Doing Parks, great. Parks is from Torque News, and he's going to help me with the drive, and it's going to be cool. He's going to drive first so I can work and take pictures and hang out. So we're going to see how fast it can go, right? Thanks, Jason. You bet. <laughs> we'll see you guys soon. Actually, that wouldn't be a bad idea. Let's do butt to butt. Let's just do. Oh, yeah, yeah. Pull it right next to it for right now, yeah. and then we'll do the nose rear. I think that's a great idea. Okay, so now we're at the farewell dinner. So after the whole event is over, and everyone is done driving the car and learning all about the car, they do, they do a farewell dinner, which is where we are right now. So we're saying farewell to everybody, and we're saying goodbye to everybody, and we'll we'll miss everybody. But this is pretty much the end. After this, we'll do one more, a couple hours of hospitality, and it's back on a plane to Chicago. Well, all I can say is this journey was amazing. It's truly amazing. I'm at the airport now, about to get on the plane. I have, uh, God, it's gonna be about a 10 hour journey till I get home with the layovers and everything, but I'm excited to get home, excited to see Honda Pro Baby, because Honda Pro Baby is one month old today, which is gonna be awesome. I don't know if you celebrate a one month old birthday or not, but we'll figure something out. I do love traveling. I think it's awesome. What I don't love is getting on and off planes throughout all the other airports because it's a pain in the butt. So I, I landed on at, where am I? I'm in Atlanta. Landed in Atlanta, gate A3. I have to take off to get back to Chicago and it's gate E24. So now I have to go all the way down to this food court that's all the way down there. I have to go downstairs, take a train, and the train, I have to go all the way to the other side of the airport. And luckily I have about an hour to do it, which isn't bad, but it still can be a pain, you know? It's called the plane train. And that's what I got for my plane train food. And I'm going B now, I'm going all the way down. I'm going all the way down, do it like elephants. It is uh, like 8.30 at night, I'm back in Chicago. Very excited to be home, excited to see my son. One month old today, so that's going to be pretty awesome. And the trip was amazing, I mean you guys saw everything, everything, everything. And it was, it was an incredible trip, I'm looking forward to the next one. Uh, I can't really announce what the next one's going to be, but I'm going to tell you that it's going to bring me again someplace warm, and you guys are going to be really excited to hear about the car that I'm going to be driving because it's not a car that we have right now, so it's going to be something new. That's it, really. So I'm going to go home and eat and go to bed. See ya.